So, to simplify an expression means to write it in simplest form. And for the kinds of expressions we're dealing with right now, being in simplest form means following all these rules. Containing no grouping symbols, all like terms are combined, and all division is written as multiplication. Okay, well with that in mind, we can see what we need to do in order to get simplest form. It's just a question of what order it's best to do these in. I think that this is the easiest order. First, we're going to rewrite all division as multiplication. And at the same time, we'll rewrite subtraction as addition, just so we only have to deal with addition and multiplication as we proceed. Next, we're going to use the distributive property to get rid of grouping symbols. And finally, we're going to combine all like terms. Okay, let's see what this looks like. We're going to simplify the expression 2x minus 5 plus 3 times 2x plus 1. Now I don't have any division here, so there really isn't much work to do in step 1. I am going to go ahead and rewrite my subtraction as addition. There we go. Next, I'm going to use the distributive property to get rid of my grouping symbols. All the action right now is in this term here, so I can rewrite this off to the side if I like. 3 times 2x plus 1 is 3 times 2x plus 3 times 1, so that's 6x plus 3. As you get more practice at this, you might find that you're able to skip writing this step out. You're welcome to skip writing that step out as long as you make no mistakes as a result. So, I've used the distributive property to rewrite. So I have 2x plus negative 5 plus 6x plus 3. Now I'm going to combine my like terms. So I'm going to write my ne x terms next to each other and my constant terms next to each other. And then I'm going to add the coefficients. So 8x plus negative 2. And if I like subtraction, I can rewrite that as 8x minus 2. This is in simplest form. It follows all the rules. No division, no grouping symbols, all like terms combined. Was that really equivalent to my original expression? Let's use our calculator to make sure. So I'm going to enter my original expression, 2x minus 5 plus 3 times 2x plus 1, just as I see it. And my answer, 8x minus 2. Second and then graph gets me the table. And looking through, I see that those agree for all the x's I'm trying. Those really do seem to be equivalent. OK, let's see another example. Let's say I want to simplify 5x minus 2 all over 7 minus 6x plus 3 all over 5. What should I do? Well, I see division here. My very first move is to rewrite that as multiplication. I need to remember that the fraction bar serves as a grouping symbol. So I'm going to need to group my numerators together. And I'll have 5x plus negative 2 times 1 7th plus negative 6x plus 3 times 1 5th. I tend to feel like it's nicer for the distributive property 
If the number I'm multiplying by is in front, I'm going to just go ahead and write it there. This negative sign means multiplication by negative 1. Negative 1 times 1 fifth is negative 1 fifth. Okay, now I'm going to use the distributive property to get rid of my parentheses. I'll have 1 seventh times 5 is 5 sevenths plus 1 seventh times negative 2 is negative 2 sevenths plus negative 1 fifths times 6 is negative 6 fifths and there's an x in that term. Negative 1 fifths times positive 3 is negative 3 fifths. Okay, grouping symbols are gone. Now I want to combine like terms. So I'll write my x terms first, my constant terms second. I've got 5 sevenths x plus negative 6 fifths x plus negative 2 sevenths plus negative 3 fifths. With longer expressions like this, I might miss copying a term. So I like to go through and check that I copied all of the terms. Okay, and now actually add the coefficients together. 5 sevenths plus negative 6 fifths and I'm going to want that as a fraction. So negative 17 35ths x plus negative 2 sevenths plus negative 3 fifths. I'm going to want that as a fraction also. Negative 31 35ths. And I can just leave it there, or if I prefer, I can write negative 17 35ths x minus 31 35ths, writing minus instead of plus a negative. 